Ponte. Good morning. If you have a SO Kindle, which is special edition, you will have lock screen. Over. Excuse me, when Hatsune Miku tells you to take your medicine, you kind of have to. If you have a special edition Kindle, it will have ads on the lock screen. And if you've modded your Kindle and set up co-reader, you will be like, I thought co-reader has custom, custom shit. Because I did, and I couldn't find it. But this post I found on Reddit has the solution for that. It just seems that special offer Kindles, I don't know if it's for good faith, from Amazon or if it's like legal reasons from Amazon but for whatever reason CoReader has set up a check to see if you have a special offer Kindle and if you do have a special offer Kindle you just can't have the option in CoReader to make custom sleep screens so all you have to do is find this file in the root of your Kindle and change this line inside of the file to true instead of false I've made a little script to um, do this automated because after updating my co-reader just inside my Kindle um, it seemed to have re-overwrite that file with the default um, and it reset. So I've made it a PS1 script um, but I'm just gonna use, I compiled it into an exe just so I can keep it on my desktop and run really easily but I get since I'm releasing this for others if anyone else needs it it's kind of shady just having an exe, so I'm putting the source code on this GitHub, link in description, and I'm going to give the exe as well. Because I just want to search in Windows for it and open it up. So you, you'll open it, and you'll need to have your Kindle connected before you press enter. And if you're in CoReader, you'll want to exit it because CoReader does not um, uh, work with connecting to your computer. Either that or it'll freak out, it'll tweak out, and it'll freak out just like me in 09. So I'm back on the regular Kindle interface, and I'm going to plug in the Kindle. And once it's connected to the computer, it'll open up, and you can hit enter on the application. When you hit enter, it'll look for that directory. Once it finds the folder, it'll immediately just do it. So right now, it's been enabled, but has been switched to true. So I just run this whenever I need to update my co-reader, um, because when I update co-reader um, just inside the Kindle, it uh, overwrites that file and then I don't want to have to go in there every time like I can but this just saves so much time out of my day to have this process. So you can exit out of it and make sure to close, uh, make sure to eject your Kindle. If it finds the file is already set to true, it will give you the option to set to false for whatever reason you would want to do that, but yeah. And now, even on my special offer Kindle, instead of having ads on my lock screen, I can go in co-reader, hit screen under settings, and then do sleep screen, wallpaper, and right now I'm going to do it from a folder that has custom images, but you can just do show custom image, or whatever else you want if you just don't want ads. Um, personally, I have some custom images in a folder, so I do the folder, and then if you want to find that folder, it's in custom images, and then folder and it'll take you through your route and then you just once you get to it you long press and then tell it and you can choose to cycle through images in order or not so now when i turn off the kindle it'll have those custom images from the folder this will persist for as long as you're in co-reader because why would you be out of co-reader you just put the kindle to sleep and then open it back up or if you have one of these deals you just hit it and then As for the images themselves, you'll want the width to ideally be 1860 and the height to be 2480. As well as you'll want to export as 8-bit black and white. So down here I've turned off convert to sRGB and embed color profile with no metadata. These images didn't actually start with color, I just edited them while they were black and white because I did... Hey baby! Thank you! Medicine. I took my medicine! I forgot to tell it I took my medicine. So under color mode, I switched it to grayscale, and then pixels, or bit, I had 8. So grayscale, 8 bit. You can do that in anything like GIMP, Photoshop, any online editor you know how to use. Again, this is MC711's method, I just put it into a little script to automate, 
So shout out to this and I will have all of the relevant links in the description. Hope this could have helped out anybody. Okay, love you, bye. Ale, ale. I feel love just like a pop star But I still the same pretty little face that you made We can't say how we almost lie I think that I ain't the one So I ain't up in the best of life Can't shit, I thought that this